My name is uh, the Reverend Hannah Elizabeth Atkins Romero. This is the end of the walkabouts in which a huge group of uh, colleagues and delegates came out to uh, support the three candidates for Bishop Suffragan. And it was an amazing time of sharing ideas and hope and vision for the diocese. Uh, it was a little tiring, but it was also inspiring and invigorating. And it has made me really proud and honored to be part of this process, even more so than beforehand, because I feel and see people's dedication to the mission of um, all of us working together to uh, shine the light of Christ in this world that needs our church now more than ever. So I am grateful to all who took their Saturday in uh, January and came out and um, brought their, uh, uh, their selves and their free time and gave it to uh, us so that we could uh, get to know a little bit better where people's concerns and hopes are. God bless. Hello, I'm the Reverend Canon K. Ryan, one of the candidates for Bishop Suffragan of the Western Region in the Diocese of Texas. So glad to be at this moment celebrating the conclusion of the walkabouts. We spent a couple days together in Austin getting to know our institutions and meeting with clergy from the Western Region. And now we've spent this day at Camp Allen with many people from across the diocese, young and old, from all, all of our communities. And it was an exciting day to hear questions and to imagine what it might be like um, to walk forward as Bishop Suffragan. I look forward to being at council, being together with brothers and sisters from across this part of Texas, as we discern and imagine together the place to which God is calling us. I look forward to celebrating with you there and with my sisters, Hannah and Glennis. Thank you so much. Hi, my name is Glennis Robinson Como, and we have just finished the walkabouts. And I am exhausted in some ways, but elated in others to see the people who took time from a Saturday to come and ask questions about our diocese, to ask questions about how the future of the future leadership of our diocese will function. And it also gave me an opportunity to hear the concerns of the churches within the great diocese of Texas, to hear what is working and what the churches need support with. And so I am just excited to have had this opportunity to become one of the candidates for the suffragan bishop of the incredible diocese of Texas. And I look forward to continued ministry in the future.